and good morning people welcome back oh hello there can you uh, can you go yeah, i think it is uh to jake coon 2 proceeding along water tour 3 in the first to sort of start building our beasts for the beast wars which are going to be coming up very soon hopefully hopefully sooner than I expect we're in water tour because we need a few beasts I found the first one last time um, I'm still looking for another I'm looking for the rage the last time we found the Zabone for Tish Light so yeah we need the, the rage for eliminate those are pretty much the only two I need. After that, it's odd bits here or there, but for the most part, I have everything I need for all of my merges. I'm still needing a few beasts though, if I remember correctly, a few eggs. Um, so I need to actually, get, when I get back to the temple, to find out what ones I'm missing, go and find them in the merging, and see if I need to pick them up from beast hunters. I know one I definitely have to pick up from a beast hunter that wasn't available until now it's the only one available in the actual game outside of that though um, it's all mostly item merging I think just taking on a few beasts though uh, the uh, Ganuga was Last one, Medi Knight, same as before. This one, the Pokey Fish, again, skill bind, same as before. There's no real changes in the skills that I'm facing. And unlike the Dark Forests, and um, I believe it's just uh, from right now, it might change later, but we're only facing beasts of the element of the forest we're in. So we're in the water forest, we're only going to be facing water beasts. The big question though is, oh, okay. Pretty stone. Hmm. Suppose it's money if I can find uh, find a uh, stash to put it in. So right now we're pretty much looking for the beasts on the platform. See which ones there are. This one looks like just pokey fish and ganuga. No oh, ganuga and ganuas. So. I don't think we're going to find the rage here. But hopefully sometime soon. Uh, the format of the way I'm going to be doing the forest is pretty much the same as before. Um, going through them once, then going through them two more times, then moving on to the next set of forests. So that really hasn't changed so we're going to see as much as possible there aren't that many interactions though so don't expect a whole lot other than the first initial tour of the for uh, the forests to mugwort oh hello there uh, yeah. 
I think this might be one where the uh, key spore is guarded by a beast hunter for a medal fight. Or I could just be wrong and just pick up the uh, key spore. So, yeah, very small island, nothing really on it. There's actually only one ogre, ogre vine that actually has anything of meaning. The, the healing fountain is nice, but I really didn't need it. So water tour four. Anything good here? I thought something appeared at behind behind me there. More pokey fish, more rogue vines, of course. So what is the one I'm actually looking for? Uh it's the one that is it's a leaf, for, uh, and it's the one that is good with magic. So the one that sort of looks like a tree. That's the uh, beast I'm looking for. If I find it, I'm just going to go through these pokefish and ganugas, uh, and if I find it, I'll show it. If not, we'll get into the ogre vines. Okay, so no um, tree beast, so it might not be here, which is unfortunate. It's not exactly what I wanted, but let's have a look in the oak vines. It might not just appear as the... It might be that they just didn't appear as the Roman enemy. enemy. It sometimes happens where it doesn't appear, but it's still... A seed beast in that particular forest. Same as the opposite is true. It may appear as a Roman enemy, but it doesn't appear as a seed beast that particular time. So it's always worth looking around. HP Bank Plus Plus book. And a lovely gem. Those are definitely wanted. Can't carry any more items. Okay. Let's just get rid of the two twill mugworts first. Because lovely gems definitely sell for more. Is anything interesting actually going to happen? Swapping a pretty stone for a lovely gem. Eh, it's, it's not bad. I um, should be picking up items which cost more, uh, that uh, sell for more than 100 anyway now. Even the Mel's Elixir 7 sell for 108, I believe it is. So they're slightly better than a uh, pretty gem. A pretty stone. And still nothing. Strange how the forest seems so quiet. And we'll leave that on the ground. Yeah. 
it feels like we're the only ones here we're not it just feels that way right now Water Tour 5. Decor has changed slightly. Uh, oh, and uh, so have the monster. Uh, so have the beasts. Psycho Crash. And I think I saw what I wanted to the right there. But two of these, same issues as before for them. They're very strong hitters, yes. But the most they can do is kill your MP. And really, I have ways of getting my MP back. Psycho Crash, not really surprised that it uh, broke down the barrier. But they're not really that bad. 1050 for just two of them though? Yeah, sure. No, you're not the one I wanted. You're... Yagi Luna. Hmm. Well, so much for getting my hopes up. But we've seen these as well. There, there should be three of them. Yeah. But it's unlikely that they're going to actually give me... Really, any sort of experience. The... Psycho Crash Beast not remember their name at this moment in time definitely are the more experienced per creature should have put my barrier up first oh well I guess I can use some uh, twill mugworts if I want to. I might actually use a uh, HP back plus book just to get edited out of my inventory. Yeah, I think that's a good idea if they don't die in one turn. Okay, I can use the HP back book, plus book. Barrier should likely go down. Yeah, there it goes. And... There we go. Just get it out of my inventory so I can pick up something... a little bit more valuable. Yeah, 945 for three enemies. <laughs> More of those. So, yeah, it's just go going through the enemies. If I find the, uh, the group I want, I'll be able to show it. If not, um, yeah, back to Ogre Vines. So this forest is clear of roaming air and enemies. Same issues apply. Um, 
this area is actually fairly large. Water Tour 5 is a fairly large map. However, with just two sets, uh, two formations of Roman enemies spread over the entire map, there was roughly around 10 to 15 actual encounters of just two formations. Yeah, it doesn't really make the the map really that worthwhile. And I'm not really expecting a whole lot in these uh Ogre vines either, to be perfectly honest. I suppose the game might throw me a curveball. I'm hoping it does. But it's islands like these which just make the end game seems like such a slog. Oh, finally, a curveball. Slimy, you might be a... um... medal fight. Riggle Roggle, I spy an enemy. Let's execute. Today, today, I'm gonna get a hug. Hug from Vanilla Slither! Definitely seems like a metal fight. And... wow. I'm not pulling any punches! Wriggle! Slimy's rule! Can you see how things have taken a jump? Um... We have fully evolved enemies on their formation. This is what I've been waiting for. Or <laughs> finally something that's actually fairly interesting. They're only slimies, to be sure. And I should beat them fairly simply. But the Beast Hunters are so much more interesting. Lifesteal on a actual hitter and bed knight on an actual healer definitely there now you've got no healing which is good well except for that little bit but uh, I'm not counting that Let's see what his wind line has. I wouldn't be surprised for maybe. Yeah, uh, I was actually expecting some uh, status effects. But straight out damage is fine as well. And the earth line. I'm expecting attack up, maybe speed up. they could just do barrier. The other two might have had something different. I wouldn't expect all of them to have had barrier. But let's put mine up. They'll defend me from the wind line. And you haven't exactly turned around either. Okay. Ah, there you go. I should break through it within two. Or the first one. That'll do fine. And now it's just a case of breaking the shield. One. 
you now know have no barrier. A slimy neck? Or maybe a wriggly? Um, well, you've only got a uh, slimy left. Just that one. Just using that to use it, pretty much. To give up? Yeah, you've decided to give up. Oh no! Out of gas! But yeah, the beast fight, uh, beast hunter fights have taken a huge jump. Five thousand five hundred experience. Nice. Oh, I couldn't win. I shall concede defeat. As promised, a present. Please take it. A slimy medal. So that's the third. Awesome, huh? I've got plenty! Well, see ya! So we're still missing... I think five medals. I think there's eight in total. Maybe... Yeah, I'm expecting eight medals total, so we still got plenty of fights against the Beast Hunters to go. So, there's our key sport. We can now continue on back to the dredges of the water tour. At least I had something interesting to show this time. Twelve mugwort, I might just use that if I can. I should be able to. Nope, I can't. I'm just going to di discard that because really it's the worst thing I can pick up. Could have been a calabas herb, it could have been, but uh, it's more likely a twill mug water, and I'd just have to del uh, discard it anyway. And calabas herbs aren't exactly special either. I don't really need the egg, and I don't really need the experience. Well, I do need the experience, but I don't really need the eggs, so I'm just going to leave it there. I'll leave them alone to uh, repopulate the place. HP back plus plus book. Another herb. I'll take the Mel's Elixir 7s because I am actually using them to just refill before fights sometimes so they're somewhat useful but that's water tour 5 so three levels here had uh, had a beast hunter fight for a medal which wasn't exactly hard but it was definitely more interesting than a lot of the things we've had around here. So next time we'll continue on to Water Tour 6, likely Water Tour 7 as well, and then back to the temple. I do have Tishalite, that is the most important one. Uh, Eliminate is going to be useful, but it's not essential right now. Tissue, uh, tissue light is the main one. But we've still got a couple of uh, forests, uh, forest uh, islands. Maybe eliminators in one of the next two. So until next time, have a wonderful day. 
have lots of fun. Goodbye.